To write the name for CF4, we first need to determine what type of compound we have. Carbon, that's right here. Carbon is a nonmetal. Fluorine, that's also a nonmetal. So two nonmetals, that means we have a covalent, also called a molecular compound. So we can use these rules here to write the name for CF4. First, we write the name for both of the elements. That's the carbon and the fluorine. Next, we'll change the ending on the second element to IDE. So we cross out the INE and write IDE. So far, we have the name carbon fluoride for CF4. Now we take into account these prefixes here and put them in front of each element based on the number of atoms that are present. Carbon, we only have one carbon, so we don't need to do anything with carbon. Fluoride, though, we have four fluorine atoms. That means tetra. So we're going to write tetra in front of the fluoride. So that makes the name for CF4 carbon tetra fluoride. If you were given the name and asked to write the formula, you'd know carbon, you just have one carbon, and then this tetra here, that means you'll have four of the fluorides, four fluorine atoms. This is Dr. V. Thanks for watching.